this video is about uh, what I term or deem to be the uh, uh, basically the gender war between black men and black women and whatnot. Um, and you know, a lot of this stuff stems from the fact of you know, um, <clears throat> black women from generations past dogging out black men, man, because you know, because I was I was watching like I'm sorry this video, man, about that, man. And he was right, man. You have you have old ass. You have old, bitter black women or whatever who have fed a bunch of garbage into their daughters, you know what I'm saying, about black men. You know, niggas ain't shit and, you know, don't trust them or they'll they do you wrong and whatnot and all type of stuff, man. I watched another Terry Banks clip, man, that he had in his info box. And the black chick who basically was a damn disgrace, you know what I'm saying, she uh, was saying how she was raised independently, you know what I'm saying, to be independent or whatnot. And, uh, you know, and don't get me wrong now, man. I do understand, you know, them kind of telling black women that because it's kind of true, man. I mean, you know, as black men, we do have problems in the society, man. I, I cannot deny that, you know. We have the hardest of all races of people, you know. So, you know, I guess telling, you know, having black men be kind of conditioned to to deal with all circumstances, is to me, is understandable, you know what I'm saying. But, you know, the problem that I have with the way that a lot of black women have been indoctrinated is that they have been indoctrinated to be independent man not interdependent with black men you know um and it's like uh i think that's the biggest problem that we're having between black men and women period man because like i said me personally man i don't have a problem with black men's strength man or strength in women in general you know my mama is a strong woman, man. You know, I love my mama to death, man. I tell you right now, I love my mama to death. I mean, um, uh, my mother, man, has accomplished so much, and she's humble about all of it, man. Mama got a master's. You know, my mama, um, is just she's just a professional black woman or whatnot, but she's humble as hell, man. She never toots her own horn at all, man. If you didn't, if you knew her, man, you wouldn't even know she had that. Because she ever, because she never talks about it, you know, and it's like you know, black men like that, man. To me, you don't see them hardly anymore, man. But um, it's like my thing is this, man. I think black men don't really understand what black men are, are talking about, you know. Um, black men don't don't resent y'all strength, man. You know what I'm saying? Um, in fact, you know, man, I'm telling you. I cheered my mama on all the way till she got her masters, man. I cheered my my little like my little relatives on, man, trying to get them to you know what I'm saying get get, get grades in school, you know, because contrary to, to what they think, man, most black men are not intimidated about black men's accomplishments, man, you know, um, but you know it's it's like with me, man, a lot of black men today, man, lack devil lack dual consciousness, man, you know. They get lost up in this stuff, man. You know, instead of realizing that, you know, um, um, corporate is corporate or whatever is whatever, you know what I'm saying, and you deal with us a, a different way, you know what I'm saying, they, um, you know what I'm saying, begin to feel like they're up above black men, you know what I'm saying, um, when they should be cheering us on, let, let me cheer them on, you know what I'm saying, I'm not just for black men's success, man, I'm not just for anyone's success, man, personally, you know, because I'm trying to be successful myself, you know what I'm saying, um, but, you know, they should be trying to support us, man, in the same way, man. You know, because like when, when I was in school, you know, say at school or whatnot, and a black chick or whatever, I met one time, I was in a tutoring lab one time, man, and a black chick heard I was in Calc 3, man, heard I was in like discrete math and all type of stuff, and she got, and she got jealous, and she got resentful, you know what I'm saying? She was like, well, Jose is, uh, is in Calculus 3 too, you know, so I'm like, man, I'm like, what the, so what? So what? You know what I'm saying? Trying to make it look like you know, what you're doing ain't all of that or something. You know what I'm saying? Like, like it ain't nothing special. Look, man, you know, um, getting through Calc 1, 2, 3 is discrete math. St our stuff is not, it's not easy, man. You know what I'm saying? Um, and what, what bothered me was the way she was trying to shoot me down. You know what I'm saying? And I noticed that with a lot of today's black men, they're almost in competition with black men. You know what I'm saying? Well, they should be rooting us on, man. I mean, why, do, why would you want to see me fail? I mean, why would you want to see me not succeed? You know what I'm saying? I'm not just a, a black man who does well. You know what I'm saying? But it seems like they get resentful when it comes across a, a black man who's, who's trying to do his thing, man. And I really understand about black women and whatnot, man. You know? Um, and 
I just don't really know where they get that type of attitude from, man. Why they like that? I, I don't understand that, man. Um, now it might not be all of them, whatever. I don't know, but the ones I come across, man, seem to be resentful when it comes to black men who actually makes it of themselves, man. You know. Um, but yeah, I just wanted to say, man. Um, you know, um, a lot of this stuff, man. I blame one. Um, oh, the black men tell them tell tell, tell them it's garbage, man. Because y'all y'all have made it so that they don't view black men. Um, I mean, um, in, you know, I'm saying without partiality, man. They view you like you already gonna be a problem. You know what I'm saying? And as a result, you have no choice but to view them the same way, man. Which is one reason why I just don't really, you know, I just look past them, man. Not because I really want to, because you know. Um, I don't want to deal with the bullshit, man. You know what I'm saying? But if I come across some decent ones, man, I won't do that, though. You know what I'm saying? I don't know. You know, it's hard to tell out here these days, man. Um, But, you know, the mindset that they're giving their daughters, man, is sabotaging black relationships altogether, man. The mindset that, that many of the older black men have given their daughters, man, is sabotaging black relationships, sabotaging relationships man, between black men and black women, you know what I'm saying? Especially, like, the younger ones. You know what I'm saying? Um, I kind of want to talk about that a little bit, man. I started to say about that.